In this video, we are going to integrate cosec inverse x. So, in order to integrate this function, we will use integration by parts. So, first of all, let u is equal to cosec inverse x and dv is equal to dx. Now, the differential du is equal to the derivative of cosec inverse x, which is minus 1 upon x times square root of x square minus 1 dx and here we will take the integral of both sides so we have v is equal to x now the formula of integration by parts is integral of u dv is equal to uv minus integral of v du now we will put the value of u so integral of cosec inverse x then the value of dv is dx is equal to uv so we will put the value of u and v so we have cosec inverse x multiplied by x minus integral of v du the value of v is x and the value of du is minus 1 upon x times the square root of x square minus 1 dx now after simplifying we have integral of cosec inverse x dx is equal to x times cosec inverse x plus integral of 1 upon the square root of x square minus 1 dx now consider this integral now in order to integrate this function let x is equal to sec theta and the differential dx is equal to sec theta tan theta d theta and the value of square root of x square minus 1 is equal to sec theta square minus 1 under root then square root of sec, sec square theta minus 1 and then sec square theta minus 1 is tan square theta so this is equal to tan theta now here we can see that the value of x is equal to sec theta and the value of square root of x square minus 1 is tan theta so we and the value of dx is sec theta tan theta d theta so we will put these values in the integral so we have 1 upon square root of x square minus 1 dx is equal to integral of 1 upon tan theta and dx is sec theta tan theta d theta and then this is equal to integral of sec theta d theta which is ln of sec theta plus tan theta let's see so we will put the value of sec theta which is x and the value of tan theta which is square root of x square minus 1 so we have ln of x plus square root of x square minus 1 plus c now we will put the value of integral it is integral over here so we have integral of cosec inverse x dx is equal to x times cosec inverse x plus ln of x plus square root of x square minus 1 plus c and this is the required integral.